Bro, what the hell is this thing? Why did a human turn into that? And why is it apples growing out of its ass? Peril. Damned humans. It was all because of them. We'll just have to make it work. The mission depends on our survival. Let's go. Burn! Vile monster. You're mine! The power of mine! Prince is my best friend, and he'd save him. I can't die in a place like this, and yet. You two run. But above all else, I am a noble, and a noble defends his people, no matter the cost. Farewell. If you would repay me, then live. Oh, buddy, crazy, crazy. Oh, damn. Confront the threat before thee, or die here in obscurity. Now choose. I choose. So be it. Heroism lies in the soul that stands firm against its fears. Oh yeah, we gonna scroll. Power awaits thy command. The time is come to awaken the hero within. We finna scroll. Brave thy very heart. Uh oh, there it is. Whoa. The hell did he just pull out his chest? Oh shit. That's one way to get powers. Summon his persona. My name is Escafloni. I ain't gonna lie, that's low key a uh, fire transformation. I can't even be mad at that. That's low key a fire transformation. What's more, it can use magic despite its lack of an igniter. Certain enemies are weak to certain affinities. After you hit one of them, after you hit one of these weaknesses, the word weak will be displayed. Hitting an opponent weakness or scoring a critical hit against them will only decrease the turn icon by half. Wind. That's 
stay calm. Let's go. Scour! I wonder if there's a limit how many times we can do this. Oh, what about his legs? Oh, is Oh, you take an apple. Gallagher knocked down the apples from here. Yes. Leave it to me. I mean, she do have a sword. She could have did that this whole damn time. So, so the main body isn't weak to anything. through this order they pursued their wishes and boldly walked a path of virtue what thou hast awakened is the true spirit of a hero the power that lies dormant in all of us the power to reforge the fear of the unknown into curiosity if thou wouldst change the world by thine own hand take this newfound power and venture forth Thy journey shall reveal thy soul's mission. What was that voice? And you! What was that power you used? You had a metal heart, and your whole body was... It was crazy! <sighs> Look, that stroll guy is still alive! I'll be damned. Someone actually survived. That voice... Grius! Oh, thank goodness, you're alive! Didn't we see him in the past? Galica, you made it. He's our man on the inside. The one I'm delivering the message to. He's badly hurt. You, boy, lend me your shoulder. We'll need to carry it. The smell of blood will draw out the beasts. Let's not hang about. I'm assuming there's no item or anything we can get off of him. Lad's out cold, but he'll live. We should be fine if we take a moment's rest here. Oh, you're a sight for sore eyes, Grius. Just wish it were under better circumstances. We're both alive, and you can't ask for much better in these parts. So, this is our newcomer, eh? How'd this boy manage to command power like that? It's like nothing I've ever seen. Do you know anything about it? I might. For now, the mission comes first. 
Ah, right. I'd better just get straight to the message. Grius, you have a new mission. Avenge the king and kill Lee Squeaburn. Oh, they found out it was him. Well, good. It's about damn time. Those scheming nobles haven't said so publicly, but every soldier knows it was nothing natural that killed the king. Damn that, Luis. Couldn't stop at one royal, could he? Wait, there's more. The prince is getting worse. We're running out of time. Here, look. I brought a treasure from the village. They called it a farsight mirror. You need to see the prince's condition for yourself. Mirror lies the through the mirror lies the prince deep in slumber hidden in the village. His highness won't last much longer. Those thorns are thick enough to claim him. Louise cast the curse. So killing him is the only way to lift it. If we wait any longer, they're just gonna crown a new king. You have to kill him? Suppose we'd better start at the beginning. Well, technically, we've seen it already, but... About 15 years ago, a child enlisted in the army. But it wasn't his age that had people talking. It was his ruthless military genius. Hero to some, monster to others. <sighs> Luis Guillermo, a prodigal tactician and a master of magla arts. Some said it was only a matter of time before he made general. The youngest the nations had. Until he attacked the prince. That night, when the prince's quarters were breached, it was no ordinary mage who cast that fatal curse. It was loose. Guillermo himself. But the son's death wasn't enough for him. Now he's got the father's blood on his hands. And if that king-slaying fiend ends up on the throne, we're all doomed. But when we were exploring the royal capital, there were a lot more Luis supporters than I expected. How can they still trust him after all that? They don't even know. Luis is cunning. He left no evidence. Accuse him as you will, but the allegations wouldn't stick. All they could do was send him as far away as possible. A post in the middle of nowhere. Plenty of soldiers never believed the charges in the first place. When they look at him, they see a capable veteran unjustly made into the noble scapegoat. Most think the Royal Army was at its best when he was in charge. And in truth, it's hard to deny. Without him, we'd never have crushed the rebel uprising so quickly. Damn the man. But he's earned his titles. He's mastered the blade, magic, and he's clearly intelligent. To the masses who want change, he seems the savior they need. If even you're that worried about him, this isn't going to be easy. Mm. That's a hell of a mission. And I want in. So that's your game, eh? Pretend to sleep, eavesdrop on the plan. You're a fool to give yourself away. If you want my blood, then let your blade strike true. I'm not going to run. Not from you, and not from a chance to do what's right. Look, Grius, he saved our lives back there. And it sounds like we could use the help. Seems like kind of a waste to kill him. Especially if he's volunteering. <sighs> then answer me this. The boy's all but a stranger to you. Yet you risk your life to save him. Why? I would live, fight, and die a noble, sir. To have done otherwise would betray my title, to say nothing of my heart. Uh, I'm losing my edge. Make me regret this, and I will slay you where you stand. You'll let him help us? Right then. My life and sword are yours. As far as the rest of the world's concerned, you perished in that castle. You'll find the job ahead will be easier for a dead man. Your lives are kept only by the blades in your hands. And you'll raise them at my command. We have to. Hmm. See the prince from his curse. Defeat Louis Guibarn. The treasonous fiend not only attacked the prince, but he murdered the king. 
Luis will also be at the royal funeral. If we are not back to the capital by then, we lose our chance at his head. But no main roads. That'll mean checkpoints and questions. We are bound for a different route. We'll cut through the abandoned mine up ahead to save us going the long way round. For tonight, see to your wounds. We'll leave at first light. But I'm counting on you. Feels like the mission is finally starting. Let's set up our camp then. Now, we should finally be able to get some rest. This is your first deployment, boy. Thank your lucky stars you survived a brush with a human. What the hell was that? It was like no beast I've ever seen. No one truly knows. They're protected by Magla, so even the sharpest steel does little good against them. They're no simple beast. All we do know is with every passing year, more of their kind tear travelers apart. That was why I was first sent undercover here, investigating. And? Did you learn anything? Simmer down, boy. There wasn't a damn thing to be found in those monsters. Ah. Well, the moon's still low. If you've any other questions, now's the time. Can't think of anything. Come on, there's gotta be something. Whatever's on your mind. Kingslayer or no, Luis has a lot of public favor behind him. To the people, he's the only man with the wit and war power to bring down humans. The military seems powerless to stop them, so he plays savior. The man's practically a monster himself. By your age, he was not only a master tactician, but damn near an archmage besides. And the three of us alone are supposed to stop him? We'll just have to blend in with the crowd at the funeral. I won't abide him surviving the ceremony. He will die by my hand. Either that or somebody's going to awaken a new power. Job delivering that message line. It's finally time for us to act, Your Highness. And I want you to ask about that power, don't you? I had a question of my own. You seem to be a great deal of a royal family before you infiltrated the army. Who were you? Nothing but a mercenary. And yet, His Majesty gave me the honor of being His Highness, the Prince's tutor in swordplay. The night of the attack, I was there. Truly incredible. I say use it or lose it. That's it. Let's get some rest. 